Electric Light Orchestra band members who have died. Electric Light Orchestra, ELO, has been a cornerstone of the progressive and symphonic rock genre since its inception in 1970. With a unique blend of rock, pop, and classical elements, Electric Light Orchestra captivated audiences worldwide. The band consisted of Jeff Lynne, Roy Wood, Bev Bevan, Richard Tandy, Kelly Graucut, Mick Kaminsky, Hugh McDowell, Melvin Gale, and Mick Kaminsky. Like many bands that have stood the test of time, Electric Light Orchestra has faced its share of losses. In this video, we pay tribute to the departed members of ELO, celebrating their contributions to the world of music. Give us a like and subscribe to our channel to watch other interesting videos. Mike Edwards a gifted cellist and founding member of Electric Light Orchestra made substantial contributions to the band's sound during its early years. Born on May 31, 1948, Edwards was known for his charismatic stage presence and exceptional musical talent. Tragically, on September 3, 2010, at the age of 62, he lost his life in a road accident involving a large hay bale while driving on a highway in Devon, England. The loss of Mike Edwards was a profound blow to Electric Light Orchestra and its fans, and his legacy as a talented musician endures. Steve Woolham, a virtuoso violinist, played an instrumental role in shaping the unique and iconic sound of Electric Light Orchestra. Alo. Joining the band in its early days, Woolham's exceptional talent with the violin elevated Elo's music, infusing it with a distinctive blend of classical elegance and rock energy. His contributions were showcased in Elo's debut album, No Answer, where his violin work added a rich layer to tracks like 10,538 Overture. Woolham's ability to seamlessly merge the classical sound of the violin with the upbeat rhythms of rock contributed significantly to Elo's signature style. Tragically, Steve Woolham's promising musical journey was cut short when he passed away at the young age of 27, leaving a void in the void in the world of music. His legacy lives on through the timeless music of Elo. A reminder of his invaluable contribution to the band's success and the enduring impact he made in the realm of rock and roll. Hugh McDowell, a gifted cellist, made a lasting impact on Electric Light Orchestra, ELO, during their golden years. Joining the band in the early 1970s, McDowell's mastery of the cello brought a unique symphonic dimension to ELO's already distinctive sound. His contributions can be heard in numerous ELO classics, such as Livin' Thing and Mr. Blue Sky, where the hauntingly beautiful strains of the cello added depth and richness to the music. McDowell's ability to blend classical elements seamlessly with rock made him an invaluable member of the band. Sadly, on November 6, 2018, McDowell passed away at the age of 65 after battling cancer. Despite his departure, his contributions to Elo's music endure, and his enchanting cello performances remain an essential part of Elo's legacy, a testament to his enduring influence on the world of rock and symphonic music. Wilfred Gibson, a virtuoso violinist, played a crucial role in shaping the sound of electric light orchestra, Elo, Joining the band during its early years, Gibson's exceptional skill with the violin added a unique and classical dimension to Elo's music. His contributions were fundamental in Elo's distinctive orchestral rock sound, seamlessly blending the grandeur of classical music with the energy of rock and pop. Gibson's violin work featured prominently in Ello's iconic tracks, like Roll Over Beethoven and Showdown, elevating the band's sound and setting them apart in the music industry. Regrettably, on March 16, 2014, Gibson passed away, leaving a void in the music world. However, his legacy lives on through Ello's enduring music, a constant reminder of the immense talent and significant contributions that Wilfred Gibson made during his time with the band. Kelly Grocutt, the gifted bassist and backing vocalist of Electric Light Orchestra, Ello, played a pivotal role in shaping the band's sound during their heyday. 
Joining L.O. in the mid-1970s, Gru Cut's distinct bass lines and dynamic vocal harmonies were a hallmark of the band's hits. His contributions to L.O.'s chart, toppers like Sweet Talkin' Woman and Don't Bring Me Down were fundamental in solidifying the band's success and were central to their live performances. Graucut's stage presence and infectious energy added another layer to the band's performances, captivating audiences worldwide. On February 19, 2009, at the age of 63, Kelly Grocut tragically passed away due to a heart attack, leaving a void in the world of music. Nevertheless, his contributions to Elo's musical legacy continue to be celebrated and cherished, a lasting reminder of his invaluable role in the iconic Electric Light Orchestra. Thanks for watching. Subscribe.